Hello and welcome to the Mandiverse. Today we are going to further explore Persona 5. We are back here in the palace for another run. I had to leave Deli's gain up some SP before I came back in here and tried some more. Looking at the map, we have a long way to go. Since they did say there was three different parts to this place. Three different facilities, I guess. But we are at the door that we should need the card for. We brought the employee ID from a chief director. Will we be able to pass through now? Of course. Well, probably. I don't like probably. And I don't like guy thinks. Those don't help. Oh boy. Yeah, we have a long way to go. I think in the weapon place was where I saw the treasure though. So at least we have the map to the treasure. So at least that's something. Right. Hell yeah, finally. You know, it's a little odd. I thought Okamura might be behind the mental shutdowns, but we haven't found anything even remotely pointing to such a secret so far. Mm. Something that important might be deeper in. Let's just keep going. I like that idea, but I don't like how long this dungeon is. Mm. Oh, going up. I thought we would have been going down. Alright. So, where are we now? Oh, gotta pass the door first. So I'm expecting this video to be quite a while before, you know, with of course a lot of editing put in. Look, that building is f uh, where the treasure is. We're not far! If it's seriously that close, can we just go from outside? No point going through there. Hmm, that might be worth a try. Quite a few shadows over here, too. Oh, tis chest. Okay, that's pretty interesting. Oh, hey, right up to the shadow's face. Nice. Shit, I have nowhere to hide. Uh, Arasifu Ofuda. What the heck is that? I don't know if I've ever used that before. I have no idea. Yeah. Surroundings. Okay. <laughs> um, let's see what everybody has to say. Well. How's progress? Hmm. We have completed approximately one third of this palace. That's a short distance. Things seem to be going relatively well. I hope we can keep this up, pay, uh, keep up this pace all the way to our goal. Just make sure you don't let your guard down. We need to stay focused in the next area as well. You're right. Though to be fair, there are still two thirds remaining. Let's try to pace ourselves from here on. What are your thoughts? So what if I have to do? I'll just leave for a day, come back again, depending on the situation, because I want to at least get to the end of this one in this episode. So the next we could just fight the boss and keep going. So I will see you guys when something happens, because I'm going to have to be fighting quite a bit of shadows before the next part. All right, we made it. The treasure's in there, yeah. Just past this building, we're definitely getting closer. I find it somewhat odd that we have still yet to see anything about the mental shutdowns. Mm. Well, this place is on the side of the corporate HQ, remember? If you ever told any employees about it, we may not find any hints toward his involvement. Worst comes to worst, we're just gonna have to get that info out of the shadow himself. Anyway, let us hurry inside. I believe the fa uh, factory comes next. Yes, because we are still on the road to going through uh -oh, three of the places, and I haven't touched the first one still. Still a problem, but we'll get there eventually. It'll take some time. Alright, we are in the factory now. This place looks lovely. Looks like an old factory, you know, one standard. Ooh. Treasure. Going oh, after that. Treasure chest. Let's open it. Yes. What do we got? A black card again. I get a lot of those. But those are used for those uh, transmutates. But I guess they could be good. I don't know. I don't know. Is there a I'm a guy I think good out of it yet. Doing transmutate. <laughs> Maybe I just don't have the right stuff. Hmm. 
All right, let's see what everybody has to say once again. So, hmm. we have completed approximately one third. Things are going well. Oh, I don't say this is going to say the same thing. Right. Oh. What are your thoughts? I was hoping for something a lot better, but <laughs> oh well. I should write something. Go ahead and do a quick save here. All right. I'm actually not doing too bad. The moth and the um, star combo is actually the best because those things are so easy to take down. Just use a uh, quick gun shot and then usually just punching the stars. This really is a factory, just like the name says. I wonder what they're making here. Do you think it's related to that Escape to Utopia thing? Hold on a sec. Ain't the guys in here moving kind of weird? Oh, wow. Yep, I think he just died. Oh, and he's down too. He did that, they're exhausted. Unfortunately, this is the exact opposite of how you would imagine a utopia to be. These conveyor belts and the positioning of the workers. This is almost identical to the company's bun factory. I can't believe this. At the very least, this is how Okumura views his workers. My apologies for saying so, Noir, but this is truly atrocious. <laughs> well, it can't be under control if we can trigger that change of heart in him, yeah? Let's go! Well, great. I guess I should have expected that. <sighs> Alright. I simply cannot believe this is how Father views his employees. Noir. Well. I thought I was going to jump down and they're all super cool like, but nope, there's a door. <laughs> Oops. Um, I guess I'll see you guys again when something happens. More shadows to defeat. Woo! Best part. Oh, shit. Mm. This smell, the treasure must be right beyond that door. This is going to be another one of those authenticate whatever things. No, there's no authentication here. Kinda anticlimactic, huh? Sure, yeah, I'm not complaining. Let's go. Well, I wouldn't be either, but only going through one place? Oh, there we go. I thought so. Wait. Whoa, we almost got crushed. That freaking hunk of metal broke way too goddamn easy. There was no point in complaining after the, at this point. We'll be forced to search for another route. But is there one? Hmm, do you think we might be able to use this brittle nature of these arms to our advantage? Uh, what do you mean by that? Do I push the arm over, maybe? Uh. Well, I kind of figured that this would be a bit of a problem. There's now what do I do? Be careful. Apparently we have to go around, so... More of this. Nothing. Console. What the? Something came out! Huh? This is the control panel for that robotic arm. It seems we can use this to set it to either five, uh, three times, five times, or ten times normal speed. I bet it'd break if we stuck on ten times speed for a long time. Changing arm speed. Um... I guess. Go for ten. <laughs> I don't really know what the point of it's going three or five. Not sure. Indeed. It appears to have broken. It was like dead instantly. I knew it was 10 times normal speed, but still, that's weak. Yes. That just proves how truly overworked these machines are. It seems any increase in workload would be would have led to its collapse. Hey. Wait, but don't you think that we might be able to walk on the broken arm? We should check it out, Joker. Yeah, I kind of figured that would be the case, but... Yeah, that is pretty poor if you only do a 10 times speed and the thing broke. It's like, wow, that's that's pretty horrible. I think it could break down at any time. Oh, man, this guy is really... Wow. I don't know, I don't really have words for this. <laughs> this guy is just, I guess, horrible, I guess, would be a word, but it's not enough to describe the guy. Anyway, time to fight some more shadows. 
Okay. Um, oh, there's a lot more here. Oh, we found another controller. Console. Bang. <laughs> um, increase arm speed. Purple one. And then the purple one goes to the yellow one. Ooh, we gotta do this. Great. Love puzzles. Hey. Look! We're getting mo- uh, we've gotten much closer. Yes, after quite the detour. But still, we can't get down there, sadly. There's no way to do that. Well, once we break the yellow arm, we might be able to. Just gotta head back to the yellow arm, or the purple arm, to get over to the yellow arm console. That. Um, but where was... Oh, here's the purple arm. Okay. Gotta beat this guy real quick. Alright, we are at the yellow console. Go ahead and change that arm speed. So it should go up to the top. Or right there, that works too. And then we should be able to jump over to it and be okay. So let me just get on this, jump and run! Run, run, run! Run, you! A little faster would be nice. Alright. So, go across here, and we should be there. Now if this is going to have the treasure in it, I doubt it, because the way it looked on the plans, there was more to do. To get to the treasure oh, room. Man. There's still more, hey. yeah. That's what I thought. There it would be more. Seems. God. So much. Gotta go through. Ah. More shadow killing. Again. I wonder how close I am. Uh, that's the wrong way. Um, looks like some stuff's gonna have to be done here. And we have that whole room right there. Then there. Then there. Oh my god. And then we're there. Yeah, this is gonna be a quite a while. There's a lot to do. Oh well. We'll get through it, eventually. It'll just take time. So around here... What the... Eh, door's over down there. From the look of it, there's only one more door. It seems we should head over there. Um... Hey, wait a second. We will not be able to reach it without passing over what appears to be a hydraulic press. Mm. Right. I guess we'll have to find a way to stop it. Let's try and find a way to do that first. Well, there's a console right here, so use that. Ah, this must be the shift controls for the press. You can select break, lunch, or unpaid overtime. Wait, break is an option? <laughs> I guess so. We may be able to get past that problematic press if we find the corresponding control panel. Let's do this, Joker. Ah, we'll go ahead and go break. I don't know what the heck the other ones are going to do, but we'll just go with break. I have no idea where those are. There's a rest and restore weary spirits. What the? Um, break time shall last for approximately five seconds. What the f... Um... Okay, then. Well, now. That? That's bullshit! Uh, what are we supposed to do in five goddamn seconds? Take a deep breath. Indeed. Five seconds is a useless amount of time for us. We can likely ignore that option entirely. <laughs> yeah, I'll say. Um, how about unpaid overtime? What does that do? We're currently in a state of constant unpaid over- Okay, never mind then. For the good of the company, glory to our wonderful president, Okamori, and him alone. Whoa, 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 hold up. What the hell did it mean constant? Working unpaid overtime is just how these workers live, so setting it to that changes nothing. What a nightmare. Yeah, there is no benefit to us if nothing changes. We can likely ignore that option entirely. So lunchtime it is. Okay, what did it do this time? It is now lunchtime! Let us consume our slapping gleefully re-energize. 
30 seconds. Oh, great. Okay. They were too weak to bother with. Now that. And through the door we go. What do we got? I'm hoping for a save place because I kind of need one right now. Um. Oh, yep, there's one right there. Cool. I was hoping for one of these because I went pretty far without having one and just, you never know what might happen, so. Disposal iron. Okay. I should write something. We'll go ahead and just save that. And we'll go ahead and do our friendly chat. Well. What's up, everybody? Mm. Hmm. This extreme scenery really makes it clear how distorted the palace ruler is. We're about halfway now, right? We need to hurry up and change my father's heart. Now is not the time to get hasty. Let us go about this one step at a time. What are your thoughts? That's probably a good idea. <laughs> One okay, step well, at a time. Go. Don't get hasty, please. We do not need that. Um, well, we'll heal up. Uh, there we go. Alright. Let us go. What else do we have to do now? Let's see. Go around here. There's an arm right here, but it's not down. Hmm. Oh, there's the control right here. So it looks like arm and press is combined, I guess. Well, that's great. This will be fun. But we'll go ahead and break that, even though he wasn't even doing anything to anything. Because there's nothing right here. What the heck was he doing? <laughs> he was just lasering down into nothingness? It's kind of a useless arm. But then it would have been pointless to put a press there, too. <laughs> Whatever, I guess. Just weird things that designers would do. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Or creators, I guess. Oh. Look! Little robots. For the company! For our wonderful president, Akumara! I do this with joy! I do this with joy! Okay. <laughs> they still respect him, even though they probably see co-workers collapse from getting overworked? It's mind control. They've been purposefully driven into a state of over-adaptation. Over what? Yes. When a person is continually faced with oppression, they come to welcome its presence. Such psychological trickery is being used here. I experienced it for first hand for many years. Fox. This is so these robots exist because father is aware that he's exploiting his employees? Yes. We should be careful though, I doubt we'll be able to communicate with these ones. We'll probably go straight into battle when we approach them. I suggest you prepare beforehand. Oh, great. Well, that's good to know. I probably gotta take them out first, or the uh... Yeah, take them out first before I can activate the arm, because they probably will attack me. So, I guess we gonna go ahead and do this then. Let's see what happens. Oh. Hmm. Can't go through here. <laughs> oh, whoop. Um, set it to lunch. But will that really do anything? I don't think that'll turn off the lasers. Um, hmm. nope. I didn't do crap for the lasers. Well, then what the heck am I supposed to do about the lasers? Guess I'll have to figure that out. Hmm. All right. We now turn down the yellow pressure. Pressure. <laughs> the yellow press. So now we are able to go fight those robots. I don't know how tough or easy they will be. They're probably like the regular blue ones, I guess. Or if one of them's too injured, then you know they do the healing thing. I will see. This will take us directly to those dangerous employees. But we have to do this. I smell the treasure somewhere past where they are. Brace yourselves. I guess. i just let that go back, and here we go. Hi, guys. For the company! For our wonderful President Okamura! Any who approaches this place will be crushed. 
We will carry out our prisoner's will with glee. Well, it's good to know that they are very um, loyal, I guess. Ah, oh, great. Ah, oh, well, that's one way to start. Attack down already. Great. Um... I guess we'll see if this works. Oh, yep, yeah, I think so. This does work. <laughs> well, um. Oh, great. More. Well, go ahead and do it again. <laughs> um. It's, um, yeah, it's gonna wear down her SP real quick. Any more? Third one? Yeah, I was waiting for it. How many more are we gonna do here? Go ahead. Man, oh man. I hope three is it, because she is going down on SP, and that is not good. Oh, yep, there she goes. Adieu. <laughs> well, that actually wasn't too bad. I'm glad I have her on the team. That physio definitely helps. Well, level 41. Sweet. New skill! Mabufula! Alright. Thank God for Mabufu. There we go. Oh, she got one too! Oh, she got Meteorama. Finally. I didn't know how long it was going to take for her to get it. It took freaking forever, I can tell you that much. Um, I guess take it up for that. Right. There we go. <laughs> the heck? That was easy as hell. Well, I mean, they're overworked, brainwashed, and forced to go up against an impossible enemy. I hope nobody ever treats me like that after I turn back into a human. C come on, let's get going. Don't look so down, Noir. Yeah. Three packs of them, though. That was quite something, and that wasted her SP a light. A light. A lot. <laughs> what in the... Fuel addition has increased output. Incinerator th uh, throughput has reached approximately 270%. The employers are being dumped into that incinerator? No, they're turning all of the worn down robots into fuel. That means the power source running this facility. That is, wow, it's people's lives. Noir, are you okay? I'm not. I bet she wouldn't be. Uh huh? I'm not going to forgive my father for this. I can't believe this is how he treats his workers. Let us go, everyone. We will change his heart no matter what. Right. We're with you all the way, Noir. Yeah, we still got quite a ways to go, though, so we're with you for quite a while. Oh, boy. This dungeon, man. Enemies aren't too bad. They aren't all that hard, but especially the triple freaking of those robots. Oh, my God. They took a lot of my SP. Noir was the only one with fizz attacks. What the... This is called the airlock area? Wait, does that mean we have to go out into space? Putting it lightly, I believe such an action would lead to our extermination. Yeah, true. Yep, yep. Well, apparently it'll be okay for like 30 seconds if you keep your eyes and mouth shut. Huh, honestly, I would have thought we'd just explode out there. For real? Don't scare us, damn it! Well, what else are we supposed to do? Well, it looks like that Omega symbol has a way we can go, though, so definitely got to take that. Oh, boy. Well, that was something. I'm leveling up, though, which is actually pretty nice. I'm level 41 now. It's not bad. Not bad. Well. Still not as much as that freaking fat guy. Well, I don't know what the heck his name is, but that freaking death grab thing he does is just uh, so annoying. Mm. Hmm. This, oh wait, they're saying the same thing, aren't they? Yep, more about halfway. That's all I need to know. Okay, let's go. Well, we're still halfway. Great. I was hoping for more. 
Oh, that's not a mega symbol. What's, what's that one? I guess it's just airlock. Man, I was hoping it'd be a mega. Uh, first, like, one first glance I saw it and it's like, oh, is that an Omega symbol? No, it's not. It is not. Just, yeah. <laughs> oh, God, that's scary. <laughs> okay, then. <laughs> that, um, that was something. Oh, we found the elevator, though. Great. Sweet. What do we got? Where are we going now? Up or down? More up. All right. Oh, goody. We got to do more of this? Is this the new thing we have to do? Oh, boy. Oh, yeah. It appears as though we will need to move about it in the same manner as before. To think we'd end up flying through space. The awe I felt at seeing that flying bank feels like a distant memory at this point. Yeah, this is even better. Oh, I think that one was an Omega symbol. Yeah, these ones are Omega. Huh. Huh? Wait a second. Active. Inactive. Some airlocks are working, but others aren't. I hope we can reach our goal with just the ones that are on. I doubt it. Because the way it says right now is that's the way I need to go, but I can't. Is this actually getting close to the end? Oh, nope. So I got one room. We're, go we're close, though. We're close. I got one more room after this, and then we're there. Almost there. So, what am I supposed to... Oh, here we go. Switches. So if I swip one, the other one's gonna go on, huh? Is it one of those kinds of things? Great. Are these switches? There is something written above each one. These symbols. I forget what the heck the A is. But I know that's Omega. What is that symbol? Man completely have a brain fart right now. I don't know what that is. Oh, so these levers switch the airlocks on and off. It looks like this should open our path through here. This is all on you, Joker. Thanks. Thanks. I like being in charge of freaking everything. <laughs> Some input would be helpful. Oh, hello. It's fucking right in my face. Alright, we are good to go. Let's go! There's a lot of flipping switches and trying to figure out which one to flip. So it looks like this is the end. We did it, you guys. That was simple. Let's keep blazing a path through here. But I think there is another one after this. But this should be the last room before we hit up the treasure room, so we're close. We're really close. Uh, what do we have to do this time? It seems the same as before, but I'm not entirely sure. Oh, it's the same, all right. I want to save room. Sweet. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you see how deep this is? This is going to be a while. Oh, jeez. That's a lot of flipping switches. But this is the last room before the weapon production. And that's the last one we got to go to before the treasure. So we are extremely close. Not doing too bad this time. That little uh, item I bought for SP recovery does come in handy a little bit, but it doesn't do it. have enough SP. And it's only if it's your turn. Which sucks, but it's the best way to do it. But it was the highest one that that doctor had. It costed 100,000 yen for it, so... It was expensive. It was expensive. Dude, I can totally get used to all this flying through space shit, but we're almost at the end. You don't look so good, Oracle. Is everything okay? <sighs> she must have gotten motion sickness. It's not much further to go to the treasure. Hang in there, Oracle. Mm, I'll try. <laughs> what are your thoughts? Anything else? Nope, we are good. Let's keep exploring. This might take a while to figure out this extremely big place. Um, I can't go that way, so this way. Onward! This does look pretty fun, but the fear of just, you know, hitting a wall and then just flying out and, you know, getting stuck somewhere, that's, that's a big fear. But it seems to be working okay for them. Um... 
Alright, well. Oh, we got a switch right here. Let's go and flip that. It's good just to you know, flip switches anyways, just to see. But getting rid of all the shadows so I can come back through is definitely the best idea. So we'll get rid of them. Oh, well, that's something. Oh, the path we came on has just been closed off. The airlock seemed to have changed. Let's proceed with caution. Interesting, I wasn't expecting that. Apparently they change randomly. Once you get into a room. Did not know that. That is quite interesting. So it should happen here too. Yep. Very interesting. I wonder if that happens the same with these as well then. I'll try it. Um, nope, but I can do that to that one. So I guess let's see what happens. I don't know. Um, nope. Still inactive. So there must be one further down I gotta go to. Okay then. Well, go ahead and wait for the shadow because he's right there. Okay. Oh, here we go. Found the orange. That should lead back to the beginning. But then that'll shut off the route I just took. So we gotta go up through here. Woohoo! Up, oh, another shadow. Uh, shadow, shadow, shadows. Be careful. Okay, okay. I think I got it. I think I got it. So you go through here to activate the other side. Go th back through the blue. Flip it so the green comes up. Uh, wait. Hold on. Hold on. No, no, no! Don't do that. Okay, I got you. Flip the blue again. I'm telling you, this is annoying, but I think I got it. So I need the blue to be activated. Go down through here, because now the green's activated, so I can get the heck out of there. Alright, so flip the orange one. Alright. Perfect. Go out through the green. Alright, good. And then the blue is activated, then we can use the orange to get out of there. Perfect. Annoying complication ways to do this, but we figured it out. Oh my god. Yay, there we are. And then you travel through the blue, and the orange is your way out. Perfect. Look at that. And we are there. Oh my god. Alright. Go ahead and use that elevator. Oh, we finally reach in the end? That shit was easy. Says you. It took me a while. Uh, Skull, all you did was follow Joker. <laughs> that is true. They do follow me. And I'm sure they did not like going through all those airlocks all over again, because I sure didn't. God, that's confusing. Figured it out eventually, though. But we are now here. Final floor. Did you notice? Hmm, these are the parts we saw in the factory area. So, this is where they're being used. But what are they? It's hard to tell just from looking. Come on, man. Dude, let's leave the factory tour for later. We gotta focus on the treasure right now. Oh. Huh? It's rare to hear Skull say something sensible. And there it is. Right there. Finally made it. Jeez, that took a long time. Is there a safe room around here somewhere? There's a chest. I'm totally oh. opening that. <laughs> Got some lockpicks for it. Might as well. Hero eye patch. Okay then. It's a weird thing to get. But all we gotta do is should just be walk down there and then we're all good. This just send the calling room. card and we're done. Oh boy. What a pain. Dude, I'm flying through all this again. They're talking about the same thing. Come on, we're at the end, guys. I did not mean to hit that again. That was my bad. What are your thoughts? Okay. Let's go. All right, we are there. So, I mean, I'm surprised they said the same thing. 
I was hoping for some different dialogue. We made it, guys. Come on. Give me some new dialogue here. Alright. What do we have to do here? It's just an easy walk up to this thing. But then there's more to do. Different ways to go around to get it, I guess. Made it. Yes, we found it. This is it. Mm-hmm. But we haven't found any information about the mental collapses. That bothers me. Oh yeah, you're right. Maybe he's hiding it. We got this far. Wouldn't it be better to just squeeze the truth out of the guy? After we change his heart, once we reach our goal, same thing. Yeah, we'll do that one. That plan is fine by me. Let's send out the calling card and take his treasure then. You can decide when we do so. We'll probably just go ahead and do it in the next episode. I could do it now, but... Eh, it's hard to say. Because once you do it, then, you know, you gotta wait the 20 days to actually do it. Hmm. It's tough to say what to do. What's up here? Anything up here? Anything in here? Robot arm. Why did I just get a robot arm? That's weird. Uh, apparently I can't go up there, but the bridge lowers to go in there to get the treasure, so... All right. So it's all about when to do it again. Cause usually I just go till like there's five days left. But then the problem is, is I can't rank up anybody's confidant because they're all worried about, you know, doing the treasure thing, Co sending the calling card. So it's like, I don't know, man. I don't know. Uh, it's hard to figure out what to do. So, I would like, you know, because I would like to show confidants, you know, as they rank up, but the only way to do that is to do, you know, the next one and then do it, and then just go ahead and, you know, play the 20 days, but that is a lot of days before the eventual thing happens. I like to do an episode where the eventual thing does happen, and usually the next one after, you know, ah, you're back. because it's only just going to be like four days. But it's hard to say what to do. So, well, a lot has happened along the way, but we're finally here. Huh? What happened? Uh, you know, the whole kerfuffle between you and Mona? Do you really got to bring that up again? It's all good. It's be it was because of your fight that we met Haru, after all. Thank you. I wouldn't be able to do this without your help. Now is not the time to thank us. The finishing touch still remains. The calling card, right? What do I need to do? You will decide when we send it. Once he does that, we'll meet up and discuss the details. I'll prepare myself for that. I'll leave it up to your capable hands, Kazuya-kun. This is Haru's first mission, and we're going after her father. Give word when you're ready. Yeah, sure. <laughs> but, um... Definitely know if I should do it now, and just play the whole 20 days out. Or wait, because I would like to know you guys' input on that one, because... The way I've been doing it is just waiting till the, you know, fifth day, then go, then do it, and then the thing happens, like, a few days later, but... I did hear, uh, see that someone said they wanted to see the confidants, which I am definitely fine with doing. But I'd have to finish this first to do the people's confidants, because I can't do anything besides the doctor, the shogi player, you know, Sojiro, people like that. I can't do my team until I finish the dungeon. So, any of you guys' help would be very helpful, whatever you guys think. If I should just wait till the five days and do it again, or just do it now and, you know, just go from there. Play the 20 days out. But for this one, I think we'll end it here. That one was a long dungeon tour, but we did it. It worked out a lot better, though. Having that SP item definitely did help. It was kind of a touch and go at the moment at the end there, because I couldn't get the uh, other two people. So they were pretty hard. They were level about 44, and I'm only level 42 now. So, 
But it worked out. We got it. We're at the treasure room. Next episode. However that will go, we'll send out the calling card and we'll defeat the boss. So, thank you for joining me for this adventure. I'll see you guys for the next adventure. Bye.